hi everyone welcome back to the next js video tutorial and in this video tutorial we are going to learn how we can create the uh, url masking with the dynamic routings so first question is that what is the url masking so sometime you are you are not looking so good so sometime they are uh, looking like uh, this this is a, a question mark title tag and equal to so you don't want to show like the url like this so you just want to show the url simply like this and because it's looks it's it's look nice all right so uh, we will hit the this url and the url which is will going to call is actual url behind is this all right so how we can do this okay so we will going to learn in this video okay so now let's start so guys if you don't know about the basing routing of the uh, next chess and we ca you can watch our previous video link is also given in the description because 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 uh, before the dynamic routing and the url masking you must have to know the basics of routing all right so now let's continue with this video so first of all i'm just going to make a function with the name of let's say post and in the post we will receive the props here and in this props uh, inside the url we will return a div simply and inside the div we will link we will uh, put a link and just continue with the a tag also so a tag will be show here let's say we are getting a uh, title inside the props so you can just write the props to title simply all right so now uh, just make it a little bit nicer so that it could be looks nice all right so now let's say uh, with your url so we have to put the href and with that we have to use the path so what path will we go here so for that uh, let's say our path is simply uh, post page and with that title and the title should be uh, equal to which is coming from the props title so we can just simply use something like this so just write here props dot title all right so okay and here we can simply call the uh, post component so just copy here and in this copy uh, just you can simply write here title and title should be like hi next years all right so now let's see. so now you can see that there is a link which will be hit on the uh, post page so we don't have the post page so if we try to hit this it will go on the 404 page all right so now let's make a post page for that so inside the page is just create a new file with the name of post.js and so make it quick we can just simply copy the code from here and we can export here export default post fine so before uh, the writing here the post we have to import the uh, routes so for that I'm just going to write here import and from next route and here you can just what we have to import we have to with routers all right because uh, this is very important uh, for uh, writing the dynamic urls all right so for making it a little bit easier so i'm just going to take a const here and uh, const name is the post and i'm going just going to take a, a with router function and this function will be uh, take as a parameter to the whole function we can see that simply and uh, 
just take it as an yeah so take take it as an uh, arrow function so this is the completed now so uh, now uh, what we have to do so we have to write remove this code and we can just simply write here h1 tag here and inside the h1 tag i can just simply write um just take single line props dot router dot query dot title okay and in the second line okay let's try to run it first of all now you can see that we got in the next phase which is here all right so these are not uh, actually masking i will tell you that how we can do with the masking and it will take this uh, little moments so it should be look like a nicer then that's why i just i'm just going to add a p tag here and here i can uh, learn dynamic url with masking okay so the same thing what i'm going to do i'm just going to uh, create one more like hi youtube So when I click on the YouTube, it will tell me at hi YouTube and it's this is a dynamic routing. So now how we can uh, mask this URL for that what we have to do simply. So first of all, uh, I'm just going to add an ID. Why it's an ID? Because uh, uh, when we uh, uh, we are just putting something like hyphen here because if we just put the space then it will automatically take the m percent 20 all right hi next js and here id like hi youtube nice and here i can just simply put here as and with the as we can put the url like p it will be a little bit shorter and here just simply write props dot id okay so i guess it should be correct um or as an error okay so i just have to use the equal to sign here okay so now let's try so what's going on I'm just clicking on the next down now you can see that nice we got a URL masking here all right with that this one also so now I'm just going to write a long string so you can just check ID my channel and here you can write please subscribe and like my video all right so now when i see here it's looking like nice but when i just see that then you can see that this is the my channel okay so this is also a very nice example okay so this is all about the url mask in the next js so don't forget to subscribe our channel give your reviews previews and comments suggestions whatever you want in the comment box and don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thanks guys. Thanks for watching this video.